Hello, Paul is the best for UK here and welcome to my video. In this video, I'm going to be looking at the Tupuno for the Commodore 64, a hardware data set emulator that we would have all loved to have back in the day. So on the Tupuno, you've got these four buttons. Now, the first one is select. This is left. No, sorry, this is right. So you can go through the options. Different options on here. Options, play. So use play to load the game. Record, you can record as well. So if we go into options. So options, you can choose what machine you want. So you have C64, VIC20 or C16. Just use a video pal or NTSC. I think that's just for region specific games, maybe. And ticker speed, ticker hold, all different functions. So I've got a memory card in here, as you can see it's still got my files for my camcorder but I've also got some games for the Commodore 64. Now these are TAPE, T-A-P files, so this does not emulate the disk drive, It's you need SD2 IEC for that but this is the uh, data set emulator. This is more nostalgic to me because in the UK most people or more people had a data set than the disk drive and that's that I'm no exception to that. So uh, we do the shift to one stop and we press play on there and as you can see it's basically the Commodore 64 now is now different. This is a tape in a tape recorder according to the Commodore 64. Now as you can see in the bottom left screen you can see that it's loading and now it will stop so it's also stops in the right place for you. So this is good for multi-load games where motor control is important. That's one good thing. That's one of the great things about this device. Because if you connect a mobile phone to your data set via a car radio cassette adapter, the mobile phone will still be playing the audio so it won't stop, but this does. Basically all you've got to do is get a micro SD card, format it as FAT32 and pull it in the back of this device. Put some games on it first and there you go as you can see the game's loading up nicely and it's very reliable it won't go wrong because the volume and everything is correct and there's no degradation of the cassette as it's not analog anymore it's a digital file you can find many tap files online too so it's really handy so you can hear the music kicking in there and that would just load up nicely and I'd, it's only a very brief unrehearsed video but I got this in the post today the 22nd of now September 2018 and uh, I thought it was a great little device that I thought I'd show you so that would just load in nicely it's more nostalgic for like the like this for example where you can hear the music while it's loading obviously on a disk drive system you disk drive you down to uh, here the ocean louders and the Activision louder in this case and um, yeah I like it it's really good so if you want an alternative to disc loading on your Commodore 64 and you don't want the hassle of tapes and old data sets that have got warm belts I highly recommend this you can buy them on eBay 22 pound and 99 pence thank you for watching goodbye